Hey guys and welcome back to the vlog. Happy New Year. This is my first video back and I really want to just get organized and like update some things in my house. So I'm here at Home Goods right now um, and I'm about to look for like a dresser or like buffet or something just to get my things organized. Um, so I'm going to take you guys along with me. And if you're new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also give this video a like and yeah, let's go inside. We walk in, we found this one. Okay, so we actually we actually found something that we really liked, so we're going to buy it. The only problem is it does not fit in our car, so we're gonna have to just buy it and like they're gonna set it aside and we'll have to come back later for it. But we also found some really cute Valentine's stuff, so I'll show you later, but so many cute little things in here. We found too many good things here. Maybe we'll do a little haul when we get home, but yep, a lot of good stuff here. So we're back from Home Goods now, and I want to show you guys. I'm gonna do a little mini haul, just show you guys what we got, just a few things that we found there. But it was actually like a successful shopping trip at Home Goods because I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I will go there like and not find anything that we're looking for. And this time, as soon as we walked in, we saw that buffet, that like uh, piece of furniture that it was like the first thing we saw um, in the footage there. But it was perfect, exactly what my sister was looking for. We loved it, she ended up buying it, and then I found some other things. I was looking for like some storage containers, and I found some super cute ones. I thought they were cute in the store, but even here at home, I think it like, goes even better um, with what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to organize the closet, so hopefully those boxes, I can put them at the top, shelf of the closet, and just like put some stuff in there so it can look more organized um, and not so messy when I open up my closet door. So that's what I'm going to do with that. But yeah, let me show you guys real quick what we ended up getting from Home Goods. So these are the other things that we got from Home Goods. This is like a storage container and honestly it might be like a laundry thing. I don't know, but we're gonna use it just like to store things in there. So we really like this pattern and the color is really cute. And then these were the boxes that I was looking for. These are the ones that I want to put in my closet to just store things, but have it look a little bit cuter. So they're just like boxes. They're not like too heavy. They're like, like a stronger like cardboard-ish feeling, but I thought they were just so cute. It's like kind of like a whitish pearly color but it's really cute i really loved it a lot um and they had these were the only two they had so that's the only bad thing about like home goods that i really wanted to buy like four ideally to have them all the same um but maybe i'll try another home goods see if they have more but these were the only sizes that they had so this one's a little bit bigger and if you notice and then this one's just a little bit smaller but i would have loved to have like two of the big ones and two of like the medium size um but you know i'll take whatever i can get so yeah and i can show you guys in another video hopefully how i organize this or how i'm using it to organize but yeah i thought the price too um i thought it was pretty good this one was 19.99 and this other smaller one i don't see the price now but i think it was like 14.99 um so it was okay it was a little more than i wanted to spend but you know home goods always has good prices so but yeah so so we got these little three things and also while i was showing you the boxes i just remembered that i put on these press-on nails for new year's and they are still going strong i really haven't done press on nails before with like glue um and i was just surprised i thought like i'd do like this and they'd fall off <laughs> but they're actually still going strong these from ulta and definitely would recommend them because it's a lot cheaper than going to get your nails done at the salon and they've lasted me like five days now so we'll see we'll see how much longer they last So now it's such a nice day outside, so we're actually going to go walk for a little bit because there's not many days, you know, in the winter when it's nice. So we're going to go outside and enjoy that for a little bit instead of working out at home. Well, I might even work out later if I want to, but um, yeah, just going outside and get some fresh air. I try to do as much as I can. God, they're a little wild. So many geese. And some are getting too close. Oh my God, they're following us. So 
so we're back from our walk it was really nice outside and we had a lot of fun walking around it's always i love getting fresh air and oh my god those geese though they were so crazy they were really wild like they were following us and i don't know if these geese have been around a lot of people or something but they were just were not scared they were getting way too close for comfort i started screaming at one point because they got so close that i was like scared i thought it was gonna like fly on me so anyways that was like an adventure oh yeah and also don't mind my tree yes i still have my christmas decorations up i'm one of those people i just i can't take it off like right after christmas it just doesn't feel right i feel like i need to have it up for like a couple more weeks at least um and maybe by like mid january that's when i usually take it down because otherwise it just it feels too soon i'm still like in the holiday spirit i don't know how you guys feel about new year's resolutions but I always make New Year's resolutions, but I do like to just have them more like ongoing goals. So it's not like I wait for the New Year to come to work on them. They're kind of things that I'm always working on. But one of the things that I really do want to continue to work on is just trying to be more active. So that's why even starting out this year, I've been going on walks almost every day as much as I can. Because, you know, it's winter, so like it could get really cold sometimes. And like then I don't have to, you know, not going to force myself to go out. Just trying to be more active and like one of my best purchases of 2022 was buying a treadmill for my house. So I have a treadmill. And that really has helped me so much because even if it's cold outside or even if it's late at night and, you know, usually I wouldn't go out to walk at night um, or super early in the morning. Anytime that I want to, I can just go on my treadmill and walk and like whether that's walking like speed walking really fast or like obviously you can run too. I don't really run, um, but or walk slow, like whatever, like that treadmill has really helped me so much because I can just go to my treadmill and walk at any time that I want. Um, so that's really helped me to be more active. So that's one of my goals that I want to keep up with. Do you guys have any New Year's resolutions? Do you guys do that? I know some people like are fans of it. Other people really hate them. So where do you guys stand on that? But I mean, I think it's always good to just have like goals for yourself. And like whether it's the New Year or not, like it's always just good to have some goals to look forward to. And actually talking about my treadmill, I'm actually going to go work out on my treadmill right now because it's getting towards the end of the day. But um like I didn't have time earlier to work out on my treadmill or anything and even though I did go for a walk that's kind of like more like a slow walk you know around the neighborhood so I'm gonna do my treadmill and I do 12 3 30 I don't know if you guys seen a video before my sister and I did a video about the 12 3 30 exercise um but it's just on your treadmill where you walk at 12 incline speed 3 for 30 minutes um and I do like a warm-up and a cool down before and after that but like that's like the main workout and I love it so much because I feel like it's just easy if you have a treadmill or even if you go to the gym and you get on a treadmill like you know what to do because i don't know about you guys but like i didn't really know like what speed is a good speed to walk on or what incline or anything so i would just kind of like put just like walk and i didn't really know if it was good or not um what i was doing so this actually really helps me because i feel like it's a really good workout like it does get me definitely like it does get my blood pumping and i just feel like afterwards i feel like i actually did something so that's what i like about it um so i'm gonna go do that because it's a little bit more intense than just walking around the neighborhood so yeah it's a really good workout that i like doing and it's i just take that as like me time i'll get on the treadmill watch videos like just do whatever and like i feel like i'm being productive because not only am i working out like i'm already working out so like i feel like it's a good excuse to like watch videos or anything during that time and i don't feel guilty i actually look forward to it every day so it's it's become more than just a workout it's just like it's honestly something just fun for me to do because I feel like I can just have like a pause. It's almost like a break from like real life and I can just work out. I'm doing something good for myself and I'm also just like recharging my energy. It's like a workout for both my body and my mind. So I love that. But yeah, so let me get to that. So this is my treadmill that I bought. It's called the Echelon and I don't know about you guys, but I didn't really know much about treadmills. Um, before I bought this one so I did like a lot of research and for like what I wanted to do just just, just like walking I really like this treadmill it's like it doesn't have much going on um, I'll show you guys here but it is really cool it's just like a, oh, it's so loud <laughs> but it just has like this little like dashboard here which will like tell you like your speed your incline all that stuff but it's just like the basics it doesn't have like a crazy amount of things going on which for me that was good I didn't want to like pay so much more money for those other like um nordic track which i know is like a great brand and everything but like it had more than what i needed at this point so um basically yeah this is the treadmill that i have and i love and i actually bought this off of amazon so i can link that for you guys uh, down below um i did my amazon storefront and i think the price was like pretty good and like i guess you can say affordable um for like everything that it does compared to other treadmills of course you know there's still like an appliance so just keep that in mind when you look at the price but i really love this treadmill Life goes up and it goes down 
I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time